can guarantee a white Christmas for the far north of Scotland. Elsewhere across the UK, the chance of snow on Christmas Day gets smaller and smaller the further south you happen to be. Not much snow around today, though. It's much too mild for that. But uh, a hint there of what's to come with that temperature in Lerwick. I think this afternoon, with the winds turning to the north, we'll see the return of wintry weather to the far north of the British Isles. Now, more and more of those snow showers will pack in overnight in the north of Scotland. Some clearer skies for central parts of the British Isles, but we keep the mild, rather damp weather in the south. And then into Christmas morning. Well, that mild, damp weather will clear out of the way. There is just the chance of the odd snowflake, perhaps over the top of Salisbury Plain and the West Country Moors, as that damp weather moves away. But it's the colder air that will be pushing in, and plenty more of those snow showers packing into the north of Scotland, and that snow is going to start to drift. Boxing Day is looking pretty good for sport, although it's likely to be a frosty morning if you're heading out to watch the GGs, and you might catch a snow flurry in Newcastle for the match during the afternoon. The end of the week's looking pretty stormy. Low pressure close by, wet and windy on Thursday. By Friday, the wind's in the north again, so it'll be turning wintry as well. So for Christmas Day, if you're moving around, watch out for the snow in the north of Scotland. Boxing Day could be icy, and the end of the week, we've got that stormy weather to look forward to. Merry Christmas.